Lord, having been drawn again together in this house of prayer, we come to you with our supplications and with our needs. For as we have come together in this house of worship, we are also conscious, and that may be in truth, conscious of your power, of the dependence especially upon your power, dependence upon your presence, dependence upon your guidance. For by nature we, Lord, are close to the things that are spiritual as we remain, even as Christians, so carnally as in slave sold under sin. And therefore, Lord, we ask that you would make room for yourself, as you did in the life of your disciples when they were sitting beside and behind, close the doors because of fear of the Jews. Oh, Lord, that fear may also strike our hearts so often. Fear for those who are outside, fear for those who are maybe inside. But, Lord, you broke through, and you showed your hands. And in your hands you showed the marks of the nails that had drilled a hole in them. It showed, Lord, that you had been victorious, that their names were written in those holes, that you had died for them. And therefore you said, 